Welcome, foolish mortals. <laughs> so, day two. I'm going to do a tag. It might not be day two. Another day. <laughs> Halloween. Fun. I'm going to do a tag. So, I'm going to tear this old book paper. It's a really old book. It sent to me in Happy Mail. Makes me feel really guilty. Tearing it up, but this is what we do, isn't it, as art journalists? I don't know, seen as somebody else already tore it. I shouldn't feel guilty for using it, should I, really? And I don't know if you can see, but right here it says his death. So perfect for Halloween page, right? Right? Of course it is. Right. Let's just glue that down. I'm going to use my medium because this paper is very thin. So we don't need. I don't need gel medium for this. My uh, thing is really bumpy. Not talking, am I? Just talk. I'm a YouTuber. I'm supposed to talk. Explain what I'm doing, but there we go. <laughs> I'm sure you don't need to explain that I am gluing paper down. <laughs> I'm going over the top to seal it as well because it is old paper. going to add that extra layer of protection. I am going to gesso over once this is dry also but so I'm just going to fill in some gaps now. Mm-hmm. 
I think I can live with that. So maybe a tiny bit more here. Yep. So we'll get that dry and we'll put a little coat of gesso on there. Head. And then I will carry on. I'm not going to heat this on here because it will melt the plastic. Okay, so let's grab the gesso, get that slapped on there. necessarily want to lose the colour of the paper but I do want to push it into the background so that when I put my first image on you can see it stands out nicely Thick this gesso so it will really die back once I've heated it and dried it. And then I need to grab my stamps out. So here we go. I'll dry it again. Okay, so I'm going to grab my stamp press. And this is a set from this image called Mr. Bone Jungle. Um, kind of wish it was just a little bigger, but there we go. I'm going to grab Skelly, Mr. Skelly here. Hickory smoke to stamp this. It's a nice dark grey. I don't think I want to go black today. I just want.
it. Uh, you just need his hips put in it. He's got a bit of a dodgy hip there. There we go, it's perfect. Uh, I need to do his head a bit more. Let's just give him a bit more definition on the head. Ooh, the paintbrush wants to join the fun. And then we want Mr. Bone Jangles himself. Pressure on it and see if this is very uneven because of all those bits of paper. So he's just going to need a little bit of going over, which is fine because we have to stamp for it to help us. CPR, there we go. Just <laughs> need a bit more smushing. I don't think it needs more ink. I think it's quite wet. Now, yes, this is what I want. I'm going to use one of the Tim Holtz stamps from Monstrous Collection, the Monstrous Collection, and I'm going to pop my sentiment there. Is that going to have enough room yet? Yeah. No, <laughs> let's do it this way.
a little bit of black I think. Or oh, let's go for ground espresso because it's just there. So let me just wipe that off a bit. There we go, that's nice. Something wicked this way comes. Let's use this one as well. And Hinges Creek in Doorless Chambers. Again, we use the um, espresso. Whoops, dropped it, and then it just popped up in there. Okay. Now I can see that the ink is quite wet, so I'm just going to give it just a quick once over with the heat tool quickly. Quickly, if I can find it. There it is. Right. Quick blast. Dicky, and now we need to find um let's see, is there anything else? I can't go really stuck. No, it's not in there, so it must be somewhere. <laughs> A second, I'll find it. Okay, got it. It's this what I was looking for. So I think I'm gonna go for the vintage photo. And I'm just gonna do it by hand. Okay. 
I like that. Um, now I need a little bit of sponge. This will do. And I think <laughs> Dare I say it's done? Mm. How about just a touch, a tiny, tiny touch? Goes grey. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Yes. Sorry, somebody else has come home shouting as if people in the same room can't hear him. There you go. Excellent. That just gives it a bit more in the background, a bit more, a bit more. Uh, actually, I think now I'm going to grab, gonna grab a little um, I don't have this in archival because it isn't on. Um, so yeah, let's go for this. I do have a thing for this one. I'm going to go... Smudge what I've just done. That's okay. I'll just add a bit more colour everywhere but the skull, I think. Not um it's 
the word I'm looking for. Obvious. But it is a slight distinction there and that just brings him forward a little bit. I stay up my hands. So, <laughs> so is that done? Hmm. Hmm. Just gonna add a little bit of the espresso with this, but I'm only going to go to the edges. Probably never gonna get that off then. Put a bit of a cable cloth, I can just move it a little bit. <laughs> so, I hope you enjoyed that. I uh, hope you enjoy my um, Halloween series, however long it might be. <laughs> Thank you for watching and I hope to see you again soon. Bye bye.